With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone. So today we are going to discuss one question on circle. So here in this question it is given that the FCC of the two points that is a point A and the point B are the roots of the equation x square plus 2x minus a square is equal to 0. And we are also given that the ordinates of those points that is the point A and the point B are the roots of the equation y square plus 4y minus b square is equal to 0. Now in such a case we need to find the equation of the circle with AB as its diameter. And after that we also need to find that the coordinates of the center is what and we also need to find the length of the radius of the circle. So let us first find the FCC of the two given points that is the point A and the point B. And those FCC would be the roots of this quadratic equation. So we are given the quadratic equation as the x square plus twice of x minus a square is equal to 0. So now we are going to solve this equation by using the quadratic formula. So if we use the quadratic formula then we get the two values of x as the minus b that is minus 2 plus minus the under root of discriminant that is b square minus 4ac. And here the b square would be 2 square that is 4 minus 4ac. So here we have the minus 4 into a that is 1 into c and c is minus a square. So minus and minus becomes plus and here we get a square like this. And this is whole divided by twice of a which is 2. So if we solve this we get the minus 2 plus minus the entire under root of here we have the 4 plus 4 a square like this whole divided by 2. And if we take this 4 common out from this under root then we get on further simplification minus 1 plus minus here we have the 1 plus a square like this. So here we have got two values of x. So here we have the x1 as we have minus 1 minus under root of 1 plus a square like this. And we also have got the value of the x2 which is the minus 1 plus the entire under root of 1 plus a square. So these are the two FCC. Now we are going to find the ordinates by using this equation. So here we have the second equation as the y square plus 4y minus b square is equal to 0. So if we find the value of y from this then we get the minus 4 by again using the same quadratic formula plus minus the entire under root of b square minus 4ac that is 16 minus 4 into 1 into c and c is minus b square. So here we get plus and here b square like this. And this is whole divided by twice of a which is 2. So from this we get the minus 4 plus minus here we have the 16 plus 4 b square whole divided by 2. And if we take 4 common out from this under root then we get the minus 2 plus minus here we have the entire under root of 4 plus b square like this. So here we have got the two ordinates that is y1 as minus 2 minus the entire under root of 4 plus b square and we also got the value of the y2 as here we have the minus 2 plus the entire under root of 4 plus b square. Now in the question we were given the point a as the x1 comma y1 like this. So we have got the a point as the value of x1 and the x1 is the minus 1 minus under root of 1 plus a square comma y1 and the y1 is here we have computed that. So the y1 is minus 2 minus the entire under root of 4 plus b square. Similarly we have also got the value of the point b that is x2 y2. So the x2 is the minus 1 plus the entire under root of the 1 plus a square like this and the y2 would be here we have the minus 2 plus the entire under root of 4 plus b square like this. So this is the point b and this is the point a. Now we know that if we have the extremities of the diameter x1 y1 and x2 y2 then from that the equation of the circle the equation of circle would be the x minus x1 multiplied with the x minus x2 plus y minus y1 times of y minus y2 and this is equal to 0. So this is the equation of the circle when we are given the extremities of the diameter as x1, y1 and x2, y2. So if we substitute the values of the x1, x2, y1, y2 from the above 
then we get the equation of the circle as here we have the x minus x1 and x1 is here we have the minus 1 minus under root of 1 plus a square so minus and minus would become plus and we get plus 1 plus under root of 1 plus a square like this times of x minus x2 so here we have the plus 1 minus under root of 1 plus a square and here we have plus y minus y1 so y minus y1 would be here we know the value of y1 as the minus 2 minus under root of 4 plus b square so minus and minus would become plus and here we have the 2 plus the entire under root of 4 plus b square into y minus y2 so here we have the y plus 2 minus the entire under root of 4 plus b square like this and this is equal to 0 so now we are going to solve this equation to get the equation of the circle so here if we consider this term and this term then here we can apply the a plus b into a minus b identity so we know that the a square minus b square is equal to a plus b into a minus b so this would be equals to the x plus 1 whole square minus b square and b square would be the square of this under root term that is 1 plus a square similarly if we do here then we get the a square minus b square so the a square would be the y plus 2 whole square like this minus b square and b square would be the square of this under root term that would be equal to the 4 plus b square like this and this is equal to 0 now we are going to solve this ahead so if we solve this then we get the equation of the circle as from here we get the x square from here we get the y square plus 2x from this bracket plus 4y from this bracket like this and now we are only left with the constant term so here we get the constant term 1 from here and from here we get the constant term as the plus 4 like this and from here we have the constant term as minus 1 minus a square and similarly from here we have the constant term minus 4 minus b square like this and this is equal to 0 so now we can see that this plus 1 and minus 1 gets cancelled out Similarly, this plus 4 and minus 4 gets cancelled out. So, if we solve this ahead, then we get the equation of our circle as the x square plus y square plus 2x plus 4y minus times of a square plus b square is equal to 0. So, this is the equation of the circle. So, now in the question, they have asked us to find the equation of the circle here. So, we have got that and at last they have also told us to find the coordinates of the center of the circle and length of the radius so now we are going to find the coordinates of the center and the length of the radius now we know that the general equation of the circle is the x square plus y square plus 2gx plus 2fy plus c is equal to 0 so this is a general equation of circle and now from this we get the center of the circle that is c as the minus g comma minus f and we have the radius of this circle as the entire under root of g square plus f square minus c so now by these results we can find the center of the circle so here the center of the circle would be by using this result we get the center as the minus g comma minus f that is minus 1 comma minus 2 from these two coefficients of x and y and similarly we are going to find the radius of the circle so the radius of the circle would be the entire under root of g square plus f square minus c so here we have the g square as 1 plus f square as 4 minus c and the c is given to us as minus of a square plus b square so here the minus and minus becomes plus and here we are left with the a square plus b square so if we solve this then we get the radius of the circle as the entire under root of a square plus b square plus 5 units so this is our solution. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.